Hey everybody, I've been asked by quite a few people, uh, what do I do for editing? How do I edit my podcast? So I'm just going to take a few minutes and I'll edit it right here so you, everybody can see how it is. Uh, I am st actually streaming this right now over at Twitch. Uh, so the first thing I do is, is I record everything in a separate track. So if I talk about a topic, that's one track, and then I switch to another topic, we've got a second, uh, a, a second track. So the first thing I do is every time I record a podcast, I, I record some silence. That's some time where I'm not saying anything. And then I just go down effect, noise reduction, and I get noise profile. And that kind of identifies what's the overall tone of the room. <clears throat> and uh, then I go to effect, after, then I select everything, control A, and I hit effect, repeat noise reduction. And now it's going through and it's finding that tone of the room and deleting it from the audio. So if there's any like fan going or uh, air conditioning hiss or anything like that, it kind of takes that and cuts it out so everything sounds a little bit better. <clears throat> you said 2.1.0, you're on 2.1.3 official super nerd? Okay, maybe I need to update. Uh, so that takes a couple of minutes it's going through and deleting all that stuff. And then once that's done, the next thing that I do is I go ahead and I do an equalizer. So the equalizer, I go to effect, I, I still have everything selected and I go to equalization. And this is just, you're gonna have to play around a little bit to find what works best for your voice. Uh, in my voice, I bring up the lows and I bring up the highs and I leave the mids alone, uh, just a little bit, not too much. And then I just, I, I leave this just the way it is every time and I hit okay. And so now it's gonna go through and it's gonna kind of equalize and it brings a little more richness to uh, my voice overall, which is really important when you are just doing audio. And now that I've got that done, I come down here to, um, this is the Spitfish DSer. You can find this, if you just Google it, you'll find it. Uh, but this basically, the sibilance sound, which is that sound that you your mouth makes when you do the S sound, it's a little piercing sometimes. And if uh, if you have a more piercing sound to it, you're gonna wanna have the Spitfish DSer and it goes through and it finds all of the sibilance and kind of gets rid of it for you. So it, it takes all of the S sounds, it just brings them down a little bit quieter so that they don't hurt people's ears. So I just hit apply and I just use the default settings for that. <clears throat> oh, okay. Uh, so Chad is telling me that I'm having a little lag with my cam. That's probably because I'm doing so much with Audacity. Audacity is 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 working real hard, and then at the same time, um, OBS is recording this and streaming this at the same time. So it's my computer's doing a lot of work right now. Uh, so now I go to effect after I've got that done and I'm going to go down to compressor and what this does is if I talk really quiet and if I talk really loud, it kind of takes the really loud and brings it down and it brings the really quiet and brings it up a little bit so that you don't have so much of a dynamic range to uh, the levels of audio or the differences in decibel. Uh, this is the settings that I use. You're going to have to mess around a little bit to find the settings that work best for you. Or you can just copy mine if you want. Um, so I do that and I just hit OK. And now it runs through it. And it's taking a while because my computer, like I said, is streaming this on Twitch, recording it for YouTube, and doing this stuff at the same thing. And it's almost done. And this actually goes much faster. You know, I noticed the waveform got a lot bigger. Now that could be pro a problem because now it's probably a little too loud. So the final step that I do to clean up the audio is I go to amplify and right here, the, and by the way, this is using Audacity, which is a free program. Uh, I go to new peak amplitude. This is the highest level that I want. And I usually say minus three. So what that does is the loudest sound that you will ever hear in my podcast should be at minus three decibels, uh, which is what I think is a good level. And most of the time it's less than that. So I hit okay. And now you're gonna see the waveforms, they're gonna kind of squish just a little bit. All right, so now that I've got that done, the next step is to delete all of this extra silence. So I'm gonna go through and I delete that at the beginning of each one. 
And I also have some at the be at the end of each one. And I don't know why this is there. That's kind of weird. And now I go to the end. By the way, if you want to go to the end of a track, it's K. If you want to go to the beginning of a track, it's J. So I go to the end of the track. Now I'm going to have to hit solo here and listen to this. Here, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye. Okay, so that is silence at the end. I just, I'm not sure why I can see a waveform there, but I'll just delete that. And you know how that kind of cuts off and then just stops? I'm just going to do a effect uh, fade out, and that'll make it a little bit cleaner at the end. And we'll just delete that. I go to the end. I delete that. I go to the end. I delete that. I go to the end. I delete that. And one more. That's it. All right. Now I hit save. So now I've got the audio is all nice and clean and ready to use. So now what I do is I have a... Uh, something called Switchcraft Template, which basically uh, just has my the, the beginning and end music built into it already. So I open that up, and it's going to open up a new Audacity file, which now it's it's trying to load it. Okay, now that it's loaded, I go to the very beginning. This is my patron, so I delete that, and I'm going to put that there that there so this is the this is the episode that i just finished recording and then this is my switchcraft um template so now i just cut patron out of there and i paste it right there and now i've got sponsor this is the last last episode sponsor i just delete that because i rec I, re I record the sponsor live each time uh, so now i've got the sponsor so now i'm going to uh, scroll over and let me scroll zoom out by the way if you hold down control and you zoom uh, scroll in and out it will zoom in and out and if you want to scroll over left and right that's holding shift now you'll notice that I've got a like I finished talking about the sponsor and then I've got a big gap here before my music starts so I just hit f5 to bring up my I don't know what the hell it's called the time shift tool is f5 and then I just drag that over whoops and then I hit f1 which is the selection tool all right, and then I'm just going to save my Switchcraft template. I'm going to come over here. I'm going to delete Patron. I'm going to delete Sponsor, and I'm going to hit Save. And now, um, this down here, this is my this is last episode basically. So I just get rid of that because I don't need it, and I save again. Uh, and then I'm going to open up File Recent. I'm going to go to Mario Sounds. Now this is not something that everybody needs to do, but it's something that I do. Because I don't just talk continuously for, uh, you know, 20, 30 minutes or whatever, what I tend to do is I, I, I split everything into segments and then I take these little sounds from old video games or old video game commercials and I put them between the segments. So, for, for instance, here I have uh, a commercial for the Atari Jaguar, which is hilarious. Uh, so I grab that, I copy it. And I'm going to paste it here. And now I look at the way this waveform is a little too hot. Like this is a little louder than that one. So I just go to effect, amplify, and I go minus three. Oh, that didn't work. So I go effect, amplify, and I'll say up here, uh, my, my, oops, uh, minus two. So now it gets two decibels lower. And I think that looks about even. So that's probably good. Uh, I'm going to go uh, grab one here for... Uh, we'll do a make sure a Nintendo one's in there. Uh, well, here's here's um, Reggie fils saying, my body is ready. And that one looks too quiet, so I go to Effect, Amplify, and I'll just do two. And then I just hit Control-R to redo the last thing, so now I'm just continually upping it until it's about the same as the previous uh, thing that it says. And we'll do... Here's a Mario Kart sound. Copy. Paste. And we'll amplify it. And then we'll go with Free Pac-Man. Copy. Oh, no. I'm, I'm done. Because I don't want to put a sound afterwards because that's where my music starts. So I don't need the Mario Sounds file anymore. And by the way, if, uh, if you find some good uh, old uh, vintage commercial sounds... Uh, just you know, email me them or you sh uh, share them with me on Discord in the feedback channel, and I will capture them and I'll use them in the show. Uh, so now that I've got that done, 
Um, there's my Switchcraft template. That's still the same. So now I'm going to select Control A to select all of the tracks on episode 193. And I'm going to go down to tracks and I'll say align tracks end to end. So now they're aligned end to end. Now I Control A again to select everything. And then I go tracks, mix. I'm going to mix and render it to a brand new track. So now it's taking all of those and putting them in one track, which then I will bring over to my template. But before I do that, I just highlight this and I go effect truncate silence. And uh, what this does is it looks for any time where I've stopped talking for less than or for more than half a second. And it basically deletes that. Uh, so it'll usually remove like 30 seconds of silence from the from the overall podcast. And now I just copy. I click over here make sure that you are on the selection tool. I click somewhere in here and then I click on the gray area and then I hit control V and now it pastes it over here and I don't need this anymore. Uh, save. And now we've got it. Now I'm going to hit F5. I drag this over here and I'm, let me shut off my music. Uh, and now let's find out how this sounds. Before we get all right, that took too long, so I'll bring it over a little bit more. Before we get started, before we get started on the news today, and now let's go to the end. Whoops, I zoomed way too far out. That was a mistake. This is the end music, and it like last episode was really big because we had a lot to talk about, so it's way over here. This episode's much shorter. So now all I do. Who followed the channel? Figure I'm out where to here, stop. And I will see you next time. Bye bye. And I want to bring this over just a little bit more and check it again. Well, I'm out of here, and I will see you next time. Bye bye. And there we go. We're done. So now I hit Control A. Well, actually, I don't think I need to do Control A. Uh, but now I go um, File and Export as MP3. And I say SC193, and I hit that, and I say okay. Now it wants to know what I'm going to call it. This is the episode title last time. Uh, now, if you have not been here before, um, I have a, a thing called Showbot, which uh, lets people um, come up with titles for the show. Uh, a, shoe, a shoe in the bag is something that I said during this particular episode. So Link31254 said that. But Vaxer said, giveaways, thoughts on Mario Tennis Aces, Fortnite for Switch, and Pokemon Quest. And you know what? That has a lot of SEO in it. So that's probably a better one to go with. And it won for votes. So I'm going to go with that one. Uh, so let me just copy that. And... paste but i just i want to make it a little bit shorter so i'm just going to get rid of the thoughts on mario tennis aces fortnite switch and pokemon quest so i think that that's a little shorter of a title which is good uh and then i just call this episode 193 and i hit okay so now it's uh taking that and uh turning it into an mp3 which then i just upload uh to my podcast provider Anyway, hopefully this uh, has been useful to you. And uh, if you have any questions on other things that I do to uh, make my podcast the way that it is, just let me know. Uh, see you later next time.